Hi everyone. So in this particular video, we'll be learning about currency. Like how can you create your own currency and how can you assign that particular currency to all the activities in your project at one go? So first of all, to create your own currency, you need to go to admin. See right now, if you see in resources, then all your prices are coming in dollars but we need to suppose create one new currency then how to create that you go to admin you go to currencies right now you see that there are several set of currencies that are coming here but what we will do is we will create one currency new currency so we will cl click on this add button and we will name this currency as sample sample currency and we will use the symbol as let us say SL. Okay. Let us say if it takes the symbol exchange rate will be, let us keep it one with respect to us dollar. Let us not change it. You can change the decimal symbol. You can change the number of decimal places. Then your comma and all you can change the comma. It displays after three or four digits and all. Then positive will be displayed in this session and negative will be displayed in this session appearance and all and general and all also you can change which you already did. So we will click on close and now this new currency has been created, but see it is not yet reflecting because we need to assign this. How to assign this? You go to edit option and here you click on user preferences. Then in the currency option right now you see that US dollar is assigned. So you go to sample currency and you assign this. So when you assign this and when you close this, now you see everything is changed to SL. So all the currencies are now becoming SL. So this is how we create our own currency and we change this currency, but let us make it back to normal. Let us make it back to US dollars only. Let us not change it. So this I did just for showing you how to do this. That means you can do this. If you want, if your project is getting executed in some very different country, very new country, and you don't know, and you don't have a predefined set of currency for that particular country, then you can create your own currency and you can assign the currency using the user preferences option. So that's all for this video. Thank you everyone.